if we have an emergency here and give you the procedure that we will be following if there are emergencies. Very unlikely to do that here, but as I lift the floor up here, you'll probably find I've got a mystery guest down below over here to assist me on my guidance. Okay? Yeah. I think you'll be largely quiet, so we just don't worry about it, okay? But uh, anyway, uh, if we have an emergency on our guidance, uh, my colleague Joe, ready to take it over there. Joe will be leading the group back down the stairwell that many of you came out here today. And as we go back down to the ground floor lobby, we will exit out of the building and uh, we'll take uh, we'll take uh, a little walk around to the shuttle service bus and I'll count and make sure that all of you got out of this building okay. Now if we can't take the stairs over there because of uh, some obstruction. Joe will be leading the group to the Nova store over here. I'll be following the group to make sure that all of you get out of the building okay. During the guided tour, we want you to stay between the wall behind you and the green stripe in front of me. Don't uh, pass those lines. Don't climb the ladders or the stairs over here. That's off limits for you. Okay. And uh, if you see a button, don't push it. If you see a cord, don't pull it. Okay. If, um, if you need to go back down to the ground floor lobby to use the restrooms and the facilities down there, you can take the stairs back down. Just be advised, when you get to the ground floor door, though, it's going to lock behind you, so you won't be able to come back up. If you need to use the elevator to get back down to the ground floor, ask my colleague Joe. We don't want you to go down there unattended by yourself, okay? So take all the pictures you want to, walk around within the room, and go on the other side if you want to as well. Okay, welcome to the observing floor of the 107-inch or 2.7-meter Harlan Smith reflector that you see here right above my head. You know, all of our telescopes here at McDonald Observatory are telescopes that utilize big reflecting mirrors. We call these reflecting-style uh, uh, telescopes. So unlike the small refractor that you see here in the white tube that I have my hand on, that smaller telescope, like your cameras, uses a lens to magnify the sky, but our telescopes are so large, in most cases, they are solely of a reflecting design. They use big mirrors to magnify and concentrate that light so astronomers can observe objects in the night sky. Now, when astronomers are observing with a telescope like this, one thing they're not doing, they're not looking through it. They're not looking through an eyepiece, like you see here, attached to the small refractor. Instead, that light is delivered into some form of electronic imaging device, like the infrared spectrograph, this uh, uh, kind of bronze and the silver boxes here attached to the back.